Good afternoon. We're back this afternoon with another local business person in our community. And uh, if you can see behind me, I got a little video playing. Local photographer, amazing photographer, award-winning photographer, Bill Barbosa is joining us today to talk about his business and also talk about uh, a little project he's working on called 40 Over 40. But I'm going to throw it out right now to Andrew Levy, real estate agent at Equifine Properties. He's actually the one who introduced me to Bill. And there's Bill Barbosa. Hey, Bill, give a wave. Hey, guys. How's it going? Good, good. So, Andrew, I'm going to let you take it away. Thank you. So, um, I'm Andrew Levy. I specialize. Hi Andrew, how's it going? I'm good. I'm good. Um, I just wanted to let everyone know that I specialize in Jupiter and Juno Beach oceanfront and seaside properties. And that's exactly how I met Bill Barbosa. I was originally looking for a photographer to do my marketing shots. And I wanted to find a local photographer and not someone, you know, in the Jupiter Farms area or central Jupiter. I really wanted to find someone who was close to the ocean. There I am. I really wanted to find someone close to the ocean, close to the beach, close to the seaside, because I knew that the vibe that they would have would um, be more along, you know, what I wanted. And, um, and I looked up Bill and um, I, I searched, I found Bill and, um, and, a, and, a, and a photographic love affair started because, <laughs> you know, I'm a pretty uh, hard, you know, I, I was a professional photographer myself and um, I've got very high standards and I'm um, pretty direct with, you know, what I want and how I want it. And, and I got to tell you something, when you find a creative artist like Bill, like someone who really connects, who understands what you want, so you don't have to keep describing it during the shoot is invaluable. And Bill, that is you to a T. Thank you, Andrew. I really appreciate that. It's actually been an absolute pleasure working with you over the last several years. We've done several photo shoots. I've uh, done photo shoots for, for some of your team members at Echo. It's, it's been really amazing. Thank you. You're welcome. And, we, and let me tell you something. Using you is just a stroke of ease and genius because, you know, a lot of people aren't terribly photogenic or they're very, um, how should I say, nervous in front of the camera. But you find a way, you and your assistant, Audi, you and your wife, you find a way to really put someone at ease. And I think that's the key of you getting these really incredible photos of people, uh, the portraiture and, um, and also the business stuff. I know that the last time we spoke, you were starting a whole business campaign to do, um, to do still photos and social media engagement for, you know, for, for local businesses and even regional businesses. Why don't you tell me a little bit about that? It's branding photography, what we're doing, and we're still doing that heavily. Um, we photograph the person, the brand, the company, and showcase them in a way that they can resell themselves. Everything is a commodity. Everything is something that's for sale. So we're able to, we were, we come up with a concept to photograph you and your team or you in the building and you and your products for you to be able to sell it on social media, your Facebook page, on print advertisement, um, the best things that truly showcase who you are. I've been very fortunate to work with a lot of great companies. And, and right now, especially with the situation that we're living in, it's so important to stay in front of your client. Number one, you want to let them know that you're there. And also you wanna stay relevant. And I know that's one thing that I've been doing and that Echo Find Properties has been doing on a daily basis because you know, right now we can't show property. Mm -hmm. um, many businesses are closed and um, the, the, the best way to stay in front of them is through email campaigns and social media. So um, your, your prior business or your, your business is so in tune with what's happening today, and even more so with the with the virus, you know that we're dealing with right now. Um, tell me a little bit about um, about your creative work in addition to your business work. Um, on the creative process, you know we do a lot of research. We have full consultations with our clients. We want to find out what's the purpose of it. Be a branding portrait, or a beauty portrait, or a family portrait. What's the true pro reason for it? and really delve out 
get into the details of it. Um, from there, we can come up with, with a, a photo scheme. We come up with a vision board. Um, so I know what type of clothes we're gonna use, what type of backgrounds we're gonna use. Are we gonna do in studio on location? Are we gonna do hair and makeup? Um, if it's an extended shoot, we'll provide food. So I really wanna make it as comfortable as possible for the clients. I remember that when we first met, I told you that I needed marketing photos because I was gonna be oceanfront, an oceanfront and seaside specialist. And you and I sat down, we created storyboards or vision boards and we executed them to the T. We shot on the pier, we shot at Jupiter Yacht Club, we shot in some of the parks right by the oceanfront and we really made a, um, a strong statement and people that have seen my brochure and that get my work from you, they, I would say that 50% of the time they comment on the photography. So that's a testament to your work, Bill. Thank you, thank you. We did work hard on, on putting it together. When you first called me, you know, you were a high-end photographer, video man in New York. So you really want to know the ins and outs about me and you did ask a lot of questions. Yeah. <laughs> and, but it worked out and it worked out absolutely beautiful. Yeah, no, that, that's, and when that happens, um, I just want everyone to know that's viewing this. When you really make that connection, if you're, you know, if you're the subject and you make the connection with the photographer or the creative, it, there's nothing better because you always know that you're being treated and you're being captured um, properly in a way that you're going to really love. And I got to tell you something. Uh, I remember that when we first sat down to our, to our editing sessions, I remember I had to battle because there were at least 60 photos that I loved, but you know, I could only choose 10. And, um, you know, so for everyone out there, let me tell you something. If you use Bill, it's going to be tough to figure, <laughs> to find the shots you want to keep. <laughs> Thank you. So, Bill, I was just reading about your 40, um, your 40 over 40 campaign, and, um, and that really rang a bell to me because, first of all, I love the name 40 over 40. Um, and, um, you know, what that, you know, that kind of says that these are special people. And I know that you're referring to 40 over 40 in the women, you know, for women. And um, you tell me, I want you to tell me a little bit about it. But before we get started with that, I just want to say that if you are over 40 and you um, have, a, have a business, you're a sole proprietor, um, maybe you work at, um, um, at a company, this would be an incredible way to get in front of people because at the end of this, there's going to be a gallery exhibition. So yep. you're going to be able to not only invite your friends and family, but potential business people to see your incredible work from Bill. So uh, Bill, why don't you explain a little more detail what it's about? The reason I came up with the 40 over 40 is with my many years of experience, almost 20 years of experience in photography, something magical happens with women between the age of 40 and 50 years old. Um, they get a divorce, um, they lose weight, they gain weight, they get remarried. Um, they haven't, their kids leave to college, so they're home alone. Things change for them and they lose themselves. So what I want to do with the 40 over 40 is to showcase them, empower them, and that's the reason for it. So you would come to the studio, it's a full hair and makeup, a full pampering session, there's a little bit of snacks and food. We have a great time, we play dress up for 90 minutes to two hours. Beautiful um, portraits that we're gonna be doing. But the portraits can be used for personal use, your home. It also can be used for your business if you want to use those for that. So it's just that great opportunity. We do a full style concept with you. We'll talk with you. We can do Zoom, not because we're still in lockdown. We do a Zoom meeting. We select your clothes. We help you um, find the right clothing if you want to go shopping. Um, you bring that all over while the makeup artist is doing your hair and makeup. We're checking out the clothes, setting them up with the right backdrops and making the magic happen. When you come back, you come back within a week and we showcase your images and we select the image that's going to be displayed at the gallery. And that's the big one. Um, you also get interviewed. Um, you also have um, some behind the scenes um, pictures that we're going to be doing as the photo trip is going, to, going through. And we're going to display that in the gallery and we're going to showcase you. 
I'm selecting 40 women to be able to do this. I didn't think I can do any more. I thought 40 was a good amount. We're running a little bit behind. We've already photographed 10. Um, and those are done, so we're doing about 30 more. So we're super excited. Just because of COVID, we're running behind. We're going to probably launch or do the gallery sometime early next year, other than later this year. Um, but I'm really excited about the project. I'm really excited about the empowering of women. It, it, it sounds incredible, especially for a local woman um, who really wants to stand out in the community. I know that um, uh, if it were me, I wish you could sneak in maybe 39 women and a man. I would do that. <laughs> I mean, you know, um, but, but it is so important to um, showcase yourself artistically and photographically because that's one of the strong, right now, video and, and, and imagery is the key, especially when you're dealing with social media and digital marketing. And having those, I call them assets, having those assets on hand are invaluable. Um, like just yesterday, um, a client said, um, a, a former client said, I've got a client who wants to sell their home in Jupiter. You know, I need something from you right away. Within three minutes, I tagged, you know, I, I, I pretty much attached three or four photos, my brochure, um, you know, a, um, a link to my video. And within five minutes, she had it. And she responded like, oh my God, wow. I can't believe how quickly you got that to me. So I have all those things in a folder and I send the appropriate videos and the appropriate imagery right away. And being able to respond right away is very key. You know, people don't want to be waiting around for stuff. So yeah, that's having, very key. Yeah, and, and having video and, um, and photos on tap is so important. Absolutely. And one great thing um, with the branding photography, it's been great to be able to see um, social media light up with some of my clients showcasing images that we did for them in the past. And they, they have tons of images to showcase their buildings, their staff, them working, them at the beach, them at a park, talking with clients. They had all those images in stock, ready to go. The timing was perfect for them. Yeah. And I, I particularly like the um the real edgy shots you know everyone has i don't want to say alter ego as if it's you know something bad but everyone has something about them that they don't always share with other people um something that they love um and um oftentimes you know they don't get a chance to um how should i say execute or or do it and and, and what you do and what you offer and what we've discussed is after the traditional photo session is done, doing something that the, that the subject would really love to do that, you know, that wouldn't be normal, like getting them to dress in a certain way. Yeah. Um, you just showed right there, it'll probably come up in the video, there was the coffee shop owner and, um, and they did this incredible um, photo shoot looking like a, a goddess. Mm -hmm. um, so I think that's a very unique, um, I don't wanna use the word selling point, but a very unique aspect that you, that you like because you help them bring out that inner subject or that inner creative in people to, you know, to do it. And I think that's fantastic. Thank you. And that's kind of what we, we try to do. And that's part of the consultation when we're chatting with our clients, our prospective clients, is what do you wanna do? Do you wanna do something totally outside the box? I recently photographed a, um, a surgeon and um, she wanted to do something different. So we first thought about doing something full evening gown, full tuxedo with her husband and the ocean. Get in the water, get wet, let's do something fun. And that's the image coming up right there. We ended up doing it at a junkyard and it was the most amazing concept and images that we've done in a long time. It was, it was so much fun. Yeah. And what that does is it allows them, you know, to be pampered, to do something they wouldn't normally do. And I think that, um, you know, if it holds true with turning 40, um, with life events, everyone is inspired to, to be something and, and to do something, you know, that's out of the box. I think that when we all turn 40, when I turn 40, when my wife turned 40, we all just had an image or a feeling that we wanted to go after, but didn't always have the outlet. That's where I think you um, 
really you know, provide a service or provide an artistic service to help them realize it. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, I'm looking forward to the 40 over 40. I think that's gonna be great. And I've got a few women that I'm gonna to talk to um, that I really think should be a part of that. Um, um, they're locals, they live in Jupiter, Palm Beach Gardens, but um, I'm gonna to talk to a few people. Um, there might even be one or two in my office that have shown incredible acuity at real estate, and um, but they're more than real estate agents. They are incredible mothers. They are incredible animal lovers. You know, um, you know. So it's really something that uh, is fantastic. And that's that's it. They're more than just a realtor. They're more than just a business person. They're a mom. They're a sister. They're a wife. They're a dog lover. An animal lover. It's more about them than they give themselves credit for. Mm -hmm. And that's why we're doing it. I think that's phenomenal. I can't wait for the exhibition. I mean, I think that I really, I can already see it in my mind. I mean, you know, uh, that's the one thing we share, Bill. We, we're, we're able to imagine things quickly and, um, and artistically. And um, actually, I just thought of you last night. Uh, a friend of mine lives, who lives in Manhattan has been taking tours around, has been, they've been walking around all five boroughs and it's like a ghost town. Yeah. So he's like, I'm taking this opportunity to shoot all of these photos of Fifth Avenue with no one on it, uh, so Times funny. Square with no one. And he's going to make these incredible, you know, images and, um, you know, put other content in there because this is, a, wherever you're living, it's a once in a lifetime opportunity to shoot your town pretty much empty. empty. Yeah, my wife and I came up with the concept last night. It's funny that you mentioned this that we want to photograph our town, our city, Jupiter Palm Beach Gardens, Quest area where we live and document how different it is today compared to the way it was two months ago. Um, with, with all the parks being closed and people wearing masks and, and, and the signs everywhere that were closed and restaurants, beautiful restaurants like Guanabana's, it's empty. Yeah. So we want to showcase that in the documentary that we're working on. I think that's a great idea. That's a wonderful idea. Fantastic. So um, I, we could go on for days, you and I. <laughs> yeah. And one day you and I will work together again creatively because I, uh, you know, it's, again, it's very rare for me to connect with someone creatively and you've really uh, been the man. So um, I really appreciate this opportunity. So thank you so much. We We've got and, a few questions, Andrew. We can't get oh, off Rob, yet. We've got a few. <laughs> I'm here. We've got a few questions for you, Bill. So okay, I'm um, gonna run. I'm, I'm I, actually I've got a listing appointment, so I'm going to run. Thank you, Bill. Thank you, Rob. And um, thank uh, you, we'll Andrew. Be in touch. Take care, Andrew. Thank you so Come much. So, you, Bill, we're not, we're not done with you yet. Even though Andrew's leaving, we're not done with you yet. Okay. We got a, we got a few questions. Um, so, someone's asking, are you doing any shoots or pieces right now? Um, with the whole situation going on, I guess. Right now, we're not doing any shoots. Um, okay. We're abiding by what uh, the governor and what the county has requested of us. Mm -hmm. um, and I know most of my shoots require hair and makeup. So we're not doing anything. Once we get the okay to go do photo shoots, trust me, we're on it. And, and I, I guess someone's saying, uh, hold on, I'm looking at all. How, how, have you, how, has you, how have you adapted to this, this change? I know it's tough for a lot of businesses, especially you know, photographers. How, how have you adapted or trying to adapt, I guess, is the key word. I had personally taken the time to learn more about my craft, learn about social media, learn about SEO, learn about my website, but also taking the opportunity to reach out to a lot of my clients and see how they're doing. I've sent them emails, I've called them, I've sent them a text. Send, uh, send a few of them cards just to let them know that I'm here for you guys. And some some friends have needed things that were there. Um, we've had a few friends, a few clients that have passed and we we're able to support them or do slideshows or videos for them because we weren't able to go to the funeral. So we've been adapting, but still being able to give back. That's amazing. And, and Bill, I know um, I'm gonna pull up. I gotta find the picture if I can find it here. Hold on. Got a bunch of pictures. Um, you did a video. Uh, oh my yeah, God, look at that. You, you did a photo shoot for my family and myself uh, last year, I believe it was. We went to Blowing Rocks. There's my oldest son 
Yeah. Um, incredible. And I'll show you the picture that Bill gets a good laugh out of every time he sees My it. My most favorite picture. This Here it is. is amazing. <laughs> Here it is. Just, <laughs> just as the ocean just waters were coming up. before they got soaking wet. <laughs> so, so we, we have this picture hanging. It's beautiful. It's a big um, canvas photo that Bill created and it's hanging on our um, living room. As soon as you walk in the house, that's one of the first photos you see. Uh, the time that Bill spends, he takes the time. He doesn't just rush it. It's not just click, 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 click. Okay, guys, we're done. We're out of here. He, he, he spends the time. He gets to know you. He interacts with your family, your kids. He goes to these special places, all these secret hiding spots that normal people don't know about. Bill knows it because he's got the eye for photography. So he's got these little tiny places he takes you to and captures images just like this one. I mean, <laughs> that's was, awesome. We had a great laugh that day, and that was it was so much fun. Um, Bill, just for anyone interested that's watching this video now, if, if when everything passes over and we go back to normalcy, how can they get in touch with you if they do want to book uh, a family photo shoot or a branding for social media? Because that's very important, as we're saying. How can they? How can they get in touch with you? How can they book you? Um, they can. They can go to my website, Bill Barbosa Photography or billbarbosa.com, whichever way works easier for them and go, links to the same. There's different links in there, the showcases. I have landing pages for everything that we do. It'd be branding, family portraits, um, high school seniors, the 40 over 40. It's all disclosed on the website or pick up the phone and call me or text me. My personal cell is 561-704-4200. I'm always available. I'm here for you. For the chat. And again, it's I did just... see um, one person put a question. Um, anybody over the age of 50. So anyone over the age of 40 is is welcome to join. Um, you're 40 to 73, and I would love to have you all. And then um, uh, my mom, my mom's watching. She loves that photo. She said she's 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 Hi, checking mom. it out. <laughs> uh, um, you know, Bill. Just explain to people too how, you know, everyone's a photographer nowadays, right? I always make that joke. Everybody's a photographer because we all have our cell phones and we can put an Instagram filter on something and wow, that's the best picture I've ever seen. But tell people the importance of hiring a professional photographer like yourself, because there, there's much more that goes into just pressing the button on the phone. There's exposures, there's lighting, there's all that. So just go through a little basic on why it's so important for a, to hire a professional photographer. I always encourage mom to take, get the cell phone out and take pictures of their kids on a daily basis just to see them grow. Uh, but when you want to get those special moments captured, uh, I use a lot of off-camera lighting. So if we have a beautiful background, I don't want it to be blown out. I want to show some of the, the detail in the skies. I want to show, like in your picture, that ocean being frozen. It's frozen because we have off-camera lighting and high shutter speed. But that was a, a millisecond of a picture that we're able to capture. It's 20 years of experience that was helped me capture that image. And that's, that's why I love that so much. And again, for all you people that are just tuning on right now to Facebook Live, we're here with Bill Barbosa, award-winning photographer, good guy, just a good man uh, from Jupiter, Florida. Um, takes the time to spend with you, to get to know you, to take those family photos, uh, engagement pictures, social media branding bill bill's big into that now and it's a huge part that if you haven't gotten professional photos done for your social media business pages instagram facebook linkedin call bill bill what's the number again people can call you at um the the easy number is 242 bill that's my office number so 242 go. bill um that's that's 242-2455 or i can be reached directly on my cell at 704-4200 Eric code five six one. Bill, why do you love photography so much? What is it about it's photography that you love? Why? I've been I've been taking pictures since I was a, a small child in, in Puerto Rico. It's just it's just something I'm able to capture this art and capture people, capture places. And I know it sounds cliche, but it's truly frozen in time. And it's it's the most wonderful thing I'm able to do. I am blessed to have the best job in the world in my opinion, to do what I do and, and, and be with people that I'm able to be with on a daily basis other than the trying times right now with COVID. 
Um, but it's been, it's, it's an amazing career to see people smile and laugh and, and then they come back to see their pictures and people say, I hate taking pictures, but you did a great job and I look amazing. That's what it's about. Is it amazing when you look back at these photos and you see a kid that may be a photograph, like there's one over your shoulder, it looks like a little baby with his little sister and his mom and dad. And then when you see them, you know, when they turn 18 and you're, man, oh you, God. I saw you when you were this big and took this picture and now you're, you're a man. How does that make you feel when you see that? It, it's, it's amazing. I photographed a family. I've been photographing now going on 20 years. Uh, photographed them when the baby was in the belly. Photographed them when they're little kids. Uh, photographed their high school senior pictures. Recently did her wedding. That is just the most magical thing. I can't wait for her to have a baby so I can do now her baby pictures. I'm not sure if it's greater or it just makes me old or I've been around for such a long time, but it really makes you feel special that they come back after so many years. Bill used to have hair. He had a full set of hair from the pictures I saw. A full set of hair. <laughs> it was uh, time to shave that thing off. But, but with Bill, you're going to get, like Andrew said, these images that it's going to take you. We, we, when me and my wife came in to look at those pictures, Bill, we, we, not that we argued, we went back and forth because the, every image was so good. We didn't want to get rid of one, but yeah. it made it that hard to go through and decide which ones we wanted. Um, and, you know, you take the time with people. What, what would be your message? We're, we're almost done here. What would be your message for people right now, uh, you know, for this tough time that we're in? What would you say to them? When we get out of it, have your family document it. Um, there's a lot that's happened over the last going on two months now. Have a beautiful family portrait session. Have a pampering session. I would love for you to, be, to call me, but call a real professional in your area and, and capture your loved ones because you never know what's going to happen. You never know what tomorrow is going to be like. But that picture will last for a lifetime. It truly does. I know it sounds cliche, but it's, it's, it's a memory. That picture behind you, Rob, is something that you will remember for the rest of your life. And you will laugh and giggle when you see it. It brings you joy. And that's what it's all about. Well said, Bill. Well said. Once again, thank you for coming on today to join us to talk about your business. Uh, for, for those who have never been to Bill or have met Bill, uh, again, I repeat it all over again. He's a great man, takes the time, spends the time, professional photographer, award-winning photographer. He lives here. So he's part of this community. He cares about this community. And during this time, like I always say, sounds cliche too, we need to support each other. We need to support local businesses like Bill. We need to go to and support Bill because Bill gives back to the community. He does it every day. Um, so, so please, if you haven't visited Bill Barbosa Photography or or, or interested in getting that family portrait when all this is said and done, or those branding. Again, I repeat, those branding uh, images and for, for social media. Bill's the guy to go to. Give him a call. Thank it's you. 561. Bill, give me the number. I forgot it already. 561 242 2455 or 242 Bill. 242 Bill. That's the easiest way for me to remember <laughs> it. Um, so give him a call. Check out his website, BillBarbosaPhotography.com. And, and check out that 40 over 40 project. That's, that's very yeah, interesting. Awesome. Uh, I put the link guys in the, in the verbiage uh, above the post here. So check it out. Give Bill a call. Local guy. Uh, Bill, love you, man. Good stuff. Dude, Thank you so much. I love, I can't wait to see you guys again. Hugs yeah. and kisses to the family. And um, we'll be getting together soon again. Thank you so much, Bill. And everyone tune in today at three o'clock. We have Ocean's Allure. That's a local clothing store, women's clothing store and jewelry store. And then 530 tonight is the big one. We got a magician performing Ooh. magic tonight. So check that out at, five, at 530. So again, for uh, Rob Moore from Echo Fund Properties and Bill Barbosa, have a great afternoon, everyone. Bye, guys. Thank you so much.